Welcome to PointYC's Tutorial Tuesday, where we show you how to use a feature or demonstrate a technique in just a couple of minutes. In this video, we're going to show you how the voxel algorithm can seamlessly match a symmetry domain. I have in front of you a very simple grid of half an aircraft, and in particular, if I zoom out a little bit, you can actually see that we have a block around the surface grid. I also have a cut right here to show you that this block has been initialized. In particular, we have our usual T-Rex cells right here, and then we have isotropic tetrahedral cells in the rest of the block. What I want to show you in this video is what happens if I choose to reinitialize this block but using voxel cells. In particular, I want you to pay attention to what happens between the voxel cells when they get close to the symmetry domain. I'm going to go to the solver. I'm going to change my algorithm to voxel. And I'm going to put in here about five transition layers. I'm going to go ahead and reinitialize my block again with voxel cells. All right, after a few seconds, my block has already been reinitialized using voxel cells. And as you can see right here, my current plane has been automatically updated. And as I mentioned, we have in here the regular T-Rex cells, and the change now is, of course, that we have voxel cells. We have our transition regions and our voxel cells. And as I mentioned, I want you to pay special attention to what is happening right here in the symmetry domain. As you can see, all the cells that were created by the voxel algorithm are nicely matching the cells in the symmetry domain. In particular, you can see right here, all these voxel cells that were created by the algorithm are now matching the quad cells that we have in the symmetry. This is an addition to Pointwise 18.3 Release 2. If you like this video, be sure to click the thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. If you have any questions or suggestions for future videos, drop us a line down below or connect with us on Twitter, which is linked in the description. Thank you all and have a pleasant Tuesday.